Hey guys, guess what's happening? I can't see my hand. <gasps> Movement. The wheel is rolling. Oof. I'm off to do day two. of the shopping because I did day one yesterday and fact is I just plain out didn't have enough time to get all the places that I needed to because frankly there was a lot of like um, things I don't usually have to buy uh, like gummy vitamins like a Sam's I don't usually have to go there um, I need to go to save a lot because now I need olives to eat I'm allowed to eat those or they're they're on my diet and I love them so hey I say why not have some good times so then I, and I just didn't I didn't even get to go into Aldi's or save a lot at all none so whew, my car is, is cold it's rainy, it's like supposed to be like 57 today, which is freaking freezing for me. Because despite the fact that I was born and raised here, uh, I moved away and as adult became as an adult I became accustomed to the desert right the, the desert rat lifestyle. <sighs> so much better. Warm. I like 70 70 is cold and I don't like it below 70. I like it to be like 80 or 85. What are you making? Oh, this is a baby cocoon. It's a baby sock. It's a baby sock. You stick your baby in it. It's like a, it's like a giant tube sock for your baby, and, and your baby can sleep in it and be warm, and the blanket never falls off or gets on their face. Yes. It's fabulous. They're great. They're great. Where are we at? Oh, we're at Dollar Tree. We're about to go in. We're gonna make the magic happen. So what are we, what's on our plan for today? Shop. We are going to shop. We're going to go to the Dollar Tree, to Aldi's, maybe save a lot, and then the Home Depot. Thermostat? Yeah, we need a thermostat for the villa. Yeah, because it's cold out today. Again, it's Ohio. <sighs> I'm, I'm like, this is like day 75 of rain in a row, and I'm just not really into it. It's cold. Yeah. For me to say it's I cold. had to put a coat on. And I'm just going to tell you, as a person who is losing fat, fat <laughs> is warm, and I'm very sad that I'm losing my protective layer, and it's like getting cold where I would need that insulation. Not sad enough to stop, though! <laughs> All right, so we are going to go into the Dollar Tree and yeah. see what's crack a lack in there. And uh, we're out, yo. See you on the flip side. Okay, we made it out of the Dollar Tree. So I went in, and on my list for Dollar Tree was 10 cans of olives and I got the Pampa black olives because they're good I like them now I did deviate from the plan you did I did deviate from the plan only slightly I got Look at the balloons. I know I love that I always see people getting balloons I never see people carrying them out though but they I got this and the reason that I got this it was a dollar of course is it's it's the for the little clipboard that I have and I ran out of paper for that so I really need it so it was a dollar and I got it so I had eleven dollars budgeted for this stop and how much did I spend I spent eleven oh seven so I'm cool okay it's because there's no tax on food huh I never even thought about that. Yeah. I could have just budgeted ten dollars. Well then it would be eleven oh seven over, so Yeah. Food. That's the I guess I never come in and just get not food. 
or just get food. I always get not food. The siren's call of the Dollar Tree. Yeah, it called me. It called. It called you? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I got coffee. So. And I'm kind of glad. One down and a couple more things to go. <laughs> All right, so I had $50.33, so I spent eleven oh seven. So I'm going to have to stop and do some math. Okay, so $50.31 minus $11.07 leaves me $39.24. And I don't like that because I feel like when the number starts with three, it makes my budget feel teeny tiny. So um, I need to go to Save a Lot and Aldi's. And essentially, I need to buy a ton of vegetable bowls. I need a lot of carrots from Aldi's. What do you say we go to Aldi's first? Aldi's or Save a Lot first? Let's go to Aldi's. Aldi's. So I could use some carrots. I have no carrots. I need carrots. I'm and I could eat raw carrots, like baby carrots. Oh, this lady's going to pull in right here. She yeah. can't do it. She should just take that one right there, but no. She's going to pull it in front of me so I can't pull through. Ah! <sighs> the struggles. The struggle is real. All right, off to Aldi's. Ta-da! All right, we went into Mart or to Aldi's. Good gravy! I don't even know what store I'm in. <laughs> we're having problems when we don't even know what store we're in, isn't it? Yeah. So here's the situation. Uh, I had thirty-nine dollars and twenty-four cents to spend. I had a small, small list. I think my list was like twenty-four dollars and forty cents at Aldi's, but because, um, really, what the heck, oh, these kids, um, I had found some things that were on sale in other places, I was able to cross off avocados and iceberg lettuce, um, so I did get the Nutty Bars, I, needed, I had three dollars for Nutty Bars, two packages of Nutties and one Swiss roll. Um, because Chris has been doing a lot of overtime and he just uses more because he eats essentially like two meals. Yeah, like 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 a bunch of meals there. Like everything like except two. for like the one meal that I cook for him. He because when he is there, I don't make breakfast for him. He just eats like our, our dinner meal, our big meal of the day, and then everything else he eats at work. And he has to have it like and and like 15 minute breaks. He gets like three 15 minute breaks or whatever, but it's like it's not like a half an hour lunch, like at a regular job, I guess. Yeah. Or at other jobs. They're all like mini 20 minute, 15 minute break things. So um, he needs like snacky stuff and like it's convenient because he can eat those and while he's walking back to his station in the forge or whatever. And it gives him more time to eat or whatever. But um, I have to pack more because he needs like just more so yeah and it's like I have to buy I buy an extra loaf of bread too because he takes four sandwiches instead of three and that four sandwich adds up anyway um, so what did I get um, four loaves of white bread I got oh they had pretzels on sale the pounder bag for 99 cents so that was the only thing I really needed that was specific to save a lot so instead of going to save a lot we're just going to skip save a lot. We're going to go back to Mark's to yeah. check that produce bin to see if we can find anything. Also, we are absolutely 100% out of melatonin. I threw the bottle away last night when I went to go in and check and count. It was really easy because it was empty. Uh, and they happen to have that at Mark's. Uh, I also, I got four avocados because that way I can have two avocados each day for seven days. Avocados are on my diet, um, are on the bulletproof diet, good times. And then I got carrots, cause you know, you know I like me some carrots. I have, a, I have a long history of buying a lot of carrots. I bought five two pound bags of carrots and they were 99 cents each, so it's $5. Cause carrots are high on his vegetable list or whatever. And I made some the other day and they were just really, really good. Especially when you put butter on them. Mm, real butter good butter so oh and then I also got a little container 99 cent container of chili powder because I don't have any and you know 
building up your spice cabinet is not a bad thing. It, it having flavor to, you know, you can add flavor. So I spent $18 and 25 cents. I had $39 and 24 cents. So I have $20 and 99 cents to spend at Mark's. So frankly, I have a ton of money to spend at Mark's. I'm going to spend like $9 on the melatonin because I got to have that. And then that means I have like 10 bucks to do as I please with. <laughs> So I'll be looking at some vegetable bowls and we'll see what we have available. We're in Mark's. You know where we're going, don't you? It's traffic, it's slow. Slow. Cantaloupe down. Thank you. <laughs> There's something. Oh, yeah. I can't. Pardon me. Not a ton again. Here it is. It's kind of what was here yesterday. Apples, 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 and this Italian parsley. This was here yesterday, and no one's. There's some more apples down here. Okay, well, I don't need any of this, I guess. Well, he'll eat those, right? My kids ate the apples, so. All right, I have another deal that's not a deal here at Mark's. So they have this split chicken breast, it's $4.23. It's a dollar off, so it's $3.23, and there's two. 0.9 pounds, it's $1.93 a pound. But dude, right next here, these are five pounds for, uh, these are five pounds, so it's five dollars, 99 cents a pound. It's just better to buy this. So, just saying, you need to do your math and you need to know what's on sale, so. Also, they have five pound bags of chicken legs that are $3.99, and this one's open. Uh, but that's an even better deal. Someone did ask me if, um, chicken thighs and chicken legs tasted different. I don't know that they particularly taste different, but there's more meat on a thigh and um, there is just less like sinew and boniness to it. So I feel like you just get better meat payoff for the pound as well. You're paying for less bone to meat ratio. And I do feel like the thigh in, in parts of the world, like in Europe, that is the best part of the chicken. That is what like we would consider the chicken breast like the best part, the premium part. In Europe, they consider the thigh the premium part. So it just is the best to me. So I do think it's better. I don't know that it tastes different, but if you're gonna cook and prepare and coat or whatever, you're going to coat um, one thigh and you're gonna get more food out of it than you are one leg. Just an opinion. If you like them, please feel free to use them. Okay. Yeah, drinking coffee. Drinking coffee. Drinking coffee. Back okay, so here is the deal. I we were in Marks. Marks happened. And there just wasn't a lot of good stuff in the markdown bin. Um and that's okay. We did get some apples for mom and her household, which is good because they are using those. I got apples last time and the kids are eating those. Um, so I got my gummy melatonin, which actually I thought was $8.97, it was only $5.49, and that was a regular price. So I got one of those, yay. And then, um, cause you know, I had $20 to burn and there was nothing in the markdown bin cause that's the first place you check, you know? So nothing there, so I spent like $5.50 and then I was like, I wanna go over and look in the frozen section and see if there's any fish. And there was some fish that I found that was wild caught salmon. It's like the pre-portioned ones. It was $4.98, which I don't know is the best price, but I was here, it was here. It was a match made in right now. It was Mr. Right Now. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it wasn't necessarily it, Mr. Mr. Right, right, but it was Mr. Right Now. <laughs> so um 
I went ahead, I got actually got three bags of those because I spent, it was $4.98. So I spent $20.80. How much money did I have to spend at Mark's? $20.99. Ah, could that have been any better? No. Like 19 cents from a budget. And I feel like I got, um, I got like everything on my list for the shop. I got plenty of vegetables. I didn't get a ton of marked down meat, but I don't know that I need a bunch of that because I have, I have stores. I have, I have stores in the freezer. Do you know what I'm saying? Um, so that's not a big deal. I'm going to feed the family. But what I did get is a bunch of ketogenic food for me, for my diet. And that makes me pretty exciting or excited. So I have enough for one uh, can of olives every day. Pampa brand, a dollar from um, Dollar Tree. I have two avocados every day, and it, and I can have like one piece of salmon, and that is going to be plenty, plenty, plenty with um, with my vegetables and butter. That's a ton. I feel like that's a ton of food. A ton, a ton of food. So. I'm going to be a full, full girl. And that's something else. I know if you were not eating a ketogenic diet, you'd be like, that's not enough food. Uh, but let me tell you, if you put some butter and some avocado on some stuff, you full. You do not, you are, you are satiated. There is much satiety involved. You do not want food again. You're just, you're just full. You're not bloated. You're not uncomfortable. You're just like, I'm good, yo. It's a ton of calories, I know, but on the ketogenic diet, you don't count calories. You just don't eat a certain amount of time, and you eat certain foods, and it's making me happy. So, that is awesome. We are going to go home, get this haul laid out, and uh, we're going to make life happen. All right, it's the second half of my grocery haul. What is it, Lily? <laughs> Nutty bars, <laughs> Swiss rolls, <laughs> wild toddlers. All right, so I got one, two, two Swiss roll or two Nutty bars and a Swiss roll. They were 99 cents each at Aldi's. I got one, two, three, four loaves of bread, 85 cents each at Aldi's. Not ready for that yet. I got these sticks, and these are Aldi sticks, yeah, and they were 99 cents. They are usually a dollar 20, but they're on sale for 99 cents. I was already there, so I'm just gonna get them. I got five, one, two, three, four, five, two pound bags of carrots. So that is, yep, count them, 10 pounds of carrots. Oh my goodness. Show them, hold them up. I got gummy, melatonin gummies, which they only understand gummies. They don't understand medicine, but that's because they have other gummies that are delicious. I got 10, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, uh oh, oh, there's 10. Uh, 10 cans of black olives from the Dollar Tree. They were a dollar each. Got a chili powder. This was 99 cents at Aldi's. And I got one, two, three, four avocados at Aldi's, and they were a dollar each. Everywhere seems to have them on sale for the same price, so I just got them. I got three of these. One, two, three. These were $4.98 at Mark's, and they should have four servings in each. So that... I will wake up in the morning and watch nine hours. <laughs> so, you got some carrots? You want to show them the carrots? Here, let's move these. All right, so um, I spent $18.25 at Aldi's. I spent $11.07 like at, I'll be like that. no, you cannot take those, don't, don't, you're not taking those, you'll be right back. Just running off with these. No, $11.07 at Dollar Tree, and $20.80 at Mark's. So, I was $0.19 cents away from my $100, so this is the second half of my haul i feel like i got a ton of food i also got a ton of food that is good for my ketogenic like diet the bulletproof diet so i, I will like keep you posted on how it goes what I'm gonna go pee. 
You get that done, girl, in the bathroom on the big girl potty. All right. All right. So, thanks for watching, guys. I will see you bye. later. Hey, bye. That doesn't seem like you went anywhere. Hmm. <laughs> Bye, guys. I'll see you later.